Dropping the ball out of the air is one of the most neglected things in your game. We've got the secret sauce, so you can take any ball out of the air right now. Very first thing you need to know is that the ground is your friend. If you have issues taking the ball out of the air, you can use the ground. What that looks like is always stopping the ball like that, right? So if a ball gets rolled or tossed out to me like this, I know I can get control of it by using gravity on my side, step over the ball. It doesn't matter. So now a different type of ball is gonna come out to me. I don't know how it's gonna be. It's up like this and the ball rests here. It's always going to do this. So if you're scared about what to do when the ball is coming out of the air, know that your ground is your best friend. The only other thing that I will say about this is if the ball comes out, you have to remember, ball comes out one more time, like this, it's up high, immediately protect the ball. I go here if the defender's here, or I turn and like this, all right? Even better if you can trap the ball while protecting, but sometimes you're gonna have to get the ball under control, and then you have to make sure that the defender is not in a place where he can take the ball from you. From there, the next easiest, easiest and most simple way for you to control the ball out of the air is with, well, let me just show you. Toss it up in the air, boom, your thigh, right? Why your thigh? Because your thigh has a huge surface area, it's easy for you to control, and it takes the cushion out of everything, all right? So toss it up higher. If you toss it up higher, I'm still going to be able to get this down, right? And that's what it is for you. And even if you do want to do something, like we said, protect the ball because that's what you're doing. Taking the ball out of the air isn't just getting it down, it's about always keeping it once it comes down. So the ball comes up again, instead of popping it back up, maybe I, I put it here because I want it down at my feet. That's where I control the ball. That's where I have the most advantage, all right? If I have to juggle, then I have to get into some other stuff, all right? Moving from the thigh to something that is also a bit of a trick is that you can kick the ball and use the force back against the ball. That sounds crazy, but here's what I mean. If he tosses the ball up for me, instead of taking it down like this, which was a nice sick touch, if you have problems with that, toss it up, keep it up. I used my thigh this time, but you know that I have control of the ball. So you can use your foot for this also. If the ball comes in, you wanna make sure you control it. Rather than taking it down, get it in the direction that you want. Now you start juggling. That's better, right? The toughest, the hardest, way to control the ball out of the air is when it's coming out of the air and you have to try and settle it and keep it up, all right? Try and keeping it on your foot or settling it like this and just getting it to drop. But there are tricks for this. You have to match the speed of the ball. If he tosses the ball up and I go, you serious, right? You can't have a giant, don't stick your leg out like a tree trunk, okay? Cushion it, come with the ball. All right, it's coming here, there we go. As the ball comes down, my foot comes down. I lock my ankle and I bring it back. That's how you can master doing this. You're gonna have to do it over and over again. So he tosses it up. There it is, I match it. There we go. It almost kisses and hugs your foot the entire way down. And the way for you to practice this is not by getting balls up here that are tossed way over your head, but like this. Each time, over and over. Now this foot, and over and over again. Once you've done it low, like this, you come a little higher and you come up to here bring it down and then you're getting higher and higher all right to the point that you're finally challenging yourself and you're trying to not let the ball move off your foot right okay now i have some sort of mastery of the ball right and you work up to that position if you do that you will be a baller you will check out everything from us right down below unisport and you will like comment and subscribe and <laughs> you'll hit the crossbar like me because that's what i'm about to do there's a crossbar. I've never missed. We know this. I was a little short. That doesn't count. Post, I, I hit the post. Let me get another ball real quick. It's because I hit the post. Because that's what I wanted to do. And now I'll hit the crossbar. I think it touched. Video over.